Hey everyone, this is Misty with Nerd News Social, and today I'm checking out the Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, uh, which was remade for the Switch. So let's uh, give it a go here, check it out. It's uh, been a long time since the original came out, and I recall this one is my, probably my favorite out of all of the Paper Mario series. Right. Go with green. Ah, the old storybook intro. Modern Mario games tend to have like really nice and fantastic intros to get you kind of in the mood for its fun and shenanigans. Oh, the people town is burning down. Oh no. All right. Indeed. Fabled treasure of Rogesport. Why do they have a gallows in the town square? It's so unlovely like that. Oh, wow. Oh, those graphics really, really, really got better. Finally, I have a minute without Toadsworth watching over me. He's so paranoid. I came all this way here on holiday. I want to be stuck with Toadsworth. It's so stifling. Once in a while, I'd like the chance to look around on my own and see what I want. But now that I'm doing it, all I see is that this town is... Oops. Oh, Missy. Missy. Won't you buy something? I have a wide assortment of knickknacks and doodads, but this is a special favorite. Well, that's a pretty box. What's inside it? This box holds a map that shows where to find treasure. But the box has a magic lock on it that will only open for a pure and noble heart. As you can see, it won't so much as budge if one such as me touches it. Oh! If the box will open for you, Missy, then you may have whatever is inside. <laughs> Go on, hold it. I suppose I could try opening it. <laughs> oh, paratrooper. If only you knew what Mario did to your friends. Mail call.
Hey, bro, check it out. A letter from Princess Peach arrived for you. I'll just read it to you. How does that sound? Ahem. Now, let's see here. Hello there, Mario. I am now on holiday, traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into possession of a mystical map. A treasure map, actually. It was inside a box I got from an old merchant in a town called Rogfort. But since it would be too difficult for me to try to go find treasure all by myself, I thought you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? I've included the map with this letter, so please, bring it with you when you come. I'll meet you at Rogueport. That means you must come. Peach! So, is she asking me or telling me? What do you know? It's true. There's a weathered old map in here with the letter. Check it out. Oh, such pretty sparkles. And there we are, the title screen. That is so neat. I'm just watching the different faces flip around. Excuse me, sir. Please, wake up, sir. The town you'd been speaking of has come into view. Look, that's Rogueport. You see, we'll arrive shortly. Please prepare to disembark. I must apologize, sir. Our arrival was delayed just a bit by rough weather. Are you quite sure you don't want to disembark here? Oh, are you quite sure you want to disembark here? I did tell you about the sordid tales about Rogueport on our way here, did I not? What's that? I'm sorry. You say there's a princess waiting here for you? Is that so? Well, uh, of course, sir. Well, if that's what you think, then I won't stop you. But, uh, you'd better be careful, sir. Don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> Don't want to do that. Well. Can I hammer that? Okay, I can. Hit this block and save all the events you've experienced so far. If you get a game over, or you start playing again from the title screen... You can continue from the last point you saved. Anytime you find a block like this on your adventure, be sure to hit it to save. Cool. What do you want, pal, huh? A princess in a pink dress. I ain't say nothing like that. No, I'd remember a princess, probably. Why do you want this, chick? Anyway, pal, owe her money. Owe you money? Or is she your girlfriend? Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> Oi, welcome to Rogueport. Bit of a nasty place, eh? You got guts coming here. You look a bit green, so I have a wee bit of advice on me. Hit that save. Block to save. Because the thing about life is, you never know when you're going to kick the old bucket. Oh. Hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak. Oh, come off it. I know you're a nosy book nerd, so don't play dumb with me. I've seen you walking around town asking for information about the Crystal Stars. Well, now I'm doing the asking. So be a good little student and tell us what you know. Right now. Never. I don't have anything to say to you creeps. Ew. I suppose it would be it wouldn't be right if a sassy little lass like you met with an untimely demise. <laughs> We're taking this firebrand to our fortress. As you command, Lord Crump. We're on it. No no. Stop right there, you weirdos. I'll scream. Really? Oh. oh, time to do a battle? These guys are so cool looking. Like I'd go anywhere with a smelly loser like you. Ugh, not likely. What? What do you think you're doing, chump? You think you can screw up my plans? Gah, it's always something. Looks like I'm going to have to give you a taste of the old crump -a bomb Can't flee this fight. Are we going to have an audience? Battle time, Mr. Man. Just find a way to beat this freak of the week, okay? Don't sweat the details. Just jump on him and hit him with your hammer. Jump. Yes, you're doing awesome. Don't let up. Ouchie. All right. Nope. Ha-ha! I remembered how to do that part. There we go. All right. Got some star points. You did it. You did it. Yes, and you got star points. That's what these little things are. Star points. Star points you get will show up there. When you get 100, you'll go up a level. Don't forget that, okay? So adorable. Bah, 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 bah. Okay. You got a couple decent shots in. I'll give you that. But unfortunately for you, that means it's go time. Punish him. And it's been so long, I don't even remember how this game started. Quick, this way. Oof, what a bunch of bozos. Let's just sneak out of here. What do you say? Dun, 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 dun. Oh man, what if you just jump back into it? What? Uh? Stop! Where'd they go, huh? You, Johnson. Did you see them? Did anyone? Ah, oh, crud. They bolted.
Bye, mister. You totally saved me. Thanks. I have just got to give you a little reward. Oh, a kiss. My name's Goombella. I'm a junior at the University of Goom. Nice to meet you. So, uh, who are you? Mario? Wait, you mean like that famous guy? Wow, I can't believe I met you here. Cool. Anyways, no offense, but it looks like you rolled into town yourself, right? Oh, what are they doing? I already hate it here. There are freaks and weirdos everywhere. It's nasty. I mean, I know the place is called Rogueport, so I should have expected it, but sheesh. I'd never come to a place like this if it weren't for some legendary treasure here. What? You're looking for the legendary treasure too? Seriously? Whoa, 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 bucko. What do you got there? Oh my gosh. Is, is that a map? You have to tell me where you got that. Princess Peach? What? Great Hoogly Boogly if it isn't Master Mario. Bit of a coincidence bumping into one another in this sort of place. Mm -hmm. So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little burg? Hmm. Huh, indeed. Princess Peach sent you a letter and a treasure map. And she told you she'd meet you here in Rogesport. Interesting. You're asking me where Princess Peach is. Um, I was about to ask you that. We stopped in this town to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship. Don't you know? I only took my eye off her for a moment, but as soon as I did, she vanished. You know how headstrong she is, Mario. I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. But at this point, I fear we must embrace the possibility that she may never return. But I'm feeling better with you here, Master Mario. Surely we'll find her. Surely. But I know my place, Master Mario, and this is not it. I leave this task to you. I believe I'll recline in the inn right over there and enjoy a spot of tea, perhaps. In fact, I highly recommend it. It's particularly... I highly recommend it, particularly if you find your HP hard points running low. Just drop in. Ho ho. Yes, anyways. A little rest there will fill up all of your HP. I must say, though, the rest of this town is a bit rough. Yes, rough indeed. If I say. If I say. Um, Princess Peach? Did he mean, like, Peach, the Mushroom Kingdom Princess? The princess who always gets nabbed by Bowser, the Koopa King. The one you rescue? Wait a second. This is wild. Princess Peach sent you on that treasure map. Wow. This is really intense. Well, where could she have gone then, do you think? Think maybe she got sick of waiting and went to find the treasure on her own? Oh, 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 I know, Mario. Come with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure. We'll show him your map. If we start looking for the treasures, then maybe we'll find some clues about Princess Beach. Great. We're all good then. Let's go, Mario. Gumbella's abilities, a primer. When you approach people or objects, you may see an icon appear over Gumbella's head. If that happens, you can press X to learn more about that person or object. Press X to learn about a person. That's Gunther, the Goomba. 
He's always complaining about being swindled or mugged. Press X to get information about nearby people, places, and objects. Press X to learn about a location. This is Rogue's Fort Square. It's the center of town in the main business district. It's crossroads where many people meet, including more than a few shady characters. Sometimes you'll learn some interesting tidbits. Try using her ability whenever you can. Alright, I've mastered them. Of course, Goombella can be quite helpful in battle, too. She can jump to attack with a head bonk, or look up enemy HP and weaknesses with her tattle ability. First off, we gotta find my professor. Thing is, since I just got to town myself, um, don't actually know where he lives. His name is Professor Frankly, and he looks like this. Oh, before I forget to mention it, from here on, if you ever feel lost or confused, try pressing ZL. That'll be my cue to share any information I know, which might help us figure out what to do next. Studying pays off. Well, here we are, folks, in the paper town of Rogueport. With all kinds of interesting characters afoot. We have a quest to find the princess. And also a quest to find a professor. So this is going to be like a real nostalgia trip for me. I do like the upgraded uh, graphics. There's even a bit of a shine to the paper here. That's great. And I think anyone looking for a trip down memory lane or a fun first time experience for a different style of Mario game should give this one a try. I want to thank you for sharing your time with me. Please hit that like button and comment to let us know how you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to Nerd News Social for more first look video game reviews, unboxing videos for cool tech and gadgets, and in person coverage at events throughout the year. Ring that bell and be reminded when new content goes live. Thank you again, and I'll see you in the next video.